Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to Houston Islamic Art Festival. My name is Rahim, Rahim Akbar, and uh, I do woodworking. You can see some example of my work over here. Uh, you can use them in uh, ceiling, as doors, as wall panels, uh, or furniture. Uh, this is something that uh, has been done in Islamic art for over centuries. Uh, and uh, I would like to promote this art in West and uh, continue the heritage of Islamic art over here in Houston. Thank you very much. Allah made us all a different shade and color Nations and tribes recognize one another Cause every single Muslim is your sister and brother So many different colors of Islam Fill the world with color painted everywhere you go Paint everything you see and tell everyone you know Quran will be your paint and your brush will be Iman So fill the world with color every color of Islam Truth is clear and blue as the sky we walk under Love is bright and loud as the lightning and thunder Peace is pure and white as the moon so full of wonder So many different colors of Islam Fill the world with color painted everywhere you go Paint everything you see and tell everyone you know Quran will be your paint and your brush will be Iman So fill the world with color, every color of Islam Smiles warm and shining like the sun upon our faces Assalamu alaikum, my name is Afifa Ayub and for the arts festival um, uh, we, my partner and I, Zainab, we um, came up with a project of making a camera, which is also, uh, we, thanks to Ibn al-Haytham, he invented the pinhole camera. So basically what we did was we took a box and we spray painted the whole thing black. And as the lens, for the lens we used a metal, a metal um, uh, piece or a metal part of a can and we poked the smallest hole possible through the can and that acted as our lens. And to allow the light to enter more easily, we placed a bigger hole on top of the lens so the light can enter more easily. And in a very, very dark room with no light in it at all, we placed the photo paper inside here and um, we sealed it up completely afterwards. After that, we took it out in a sunny area and we opened the lens for three to five seconds and um, we allowed it to be exposed. And after that we closed it and on a sunny day you would get pictures like this and this and on a cloudy day you would get pictures like this and this and that would be if you exposed it for three to five minutes. And uh, basically what happens is the light enters through the hole and it reflects onto the paper which makes the image mirrored and upside down. So um, basically that's, that's what it happened. Hope is rich and green as the trees of an oasis The colors of Islam bloom in so many places So many different colors of Islam Fill the world with color painted everywhere you go Paint everything you see and tell everyone you know Quran will be your paint and your brush will be Iman So fill the world with color, every color of Islam Fill the world with color painted everywhere you go Paint everything you see and tell everyone you know Quran will be your paint and your brush will be Iman So fill the world with color, every color of Islam Fill the world with color painted everywhere you go Paint everything you see and tell everyone you know Quran will be your paint and your brush will be Iman So fill the world with color, every color of Islam Fill the world with color Every color of Islam Assalamu my name is Hina, I'm from Louisiana. Um, I am a self-taught artist. I've been interested in art pretty much my whole life. Um, it's been a passion of mine, a hobby of mine. And I started out painting and drawing and coloring um, at a young age, but as I got older, I got more interested in Islamic art. And um, now that I'm more interested in Islamic art, it really helps me to learn more about my religion and um, you know what my religion teaches me, so I use it as um, a way of just learning more. Um, so uh, I 
understand that we're not supposed to draw or imitate um, animals and human figures, so you know, I try to incorporate that learning in my paintings as well and all of my art forms. Um, and uh, my website is um, on Facebook. It's facebook.com slash celebrate Islam. That's the name of my company. And um, I just do it as a hobby, so um, please uh, like me on Facebook <laughs> and um, tell all your friends about it. And uh, my intention, inshallah, is to donate a portion of all the proceeds that I sell from my paintings to Islamic causes. Um, and that's what really uh, drove me to start this endeavor. So thank you so much. A whisper of peace moving through the land. Allah will surely run to us if we hold out our hand. A word of hope, a call to every woman and man. A light unto the end of time, this is Al Islam. A whisper of peace moving through the land. Allah will surely run to us, but do we understand? A word of hope, a call to every woman and man. A light unto the end of time, is this Al Islam? A whisper a of peace, moving through the land. Through Allah will surely Allah run to us, but, but do we understand? A word of a hope, word a call, a call to every woman to and man. Light unto the Light end of time, the end is this is Al Islam. A whisper of peace, moving through the land. Allah will surely run to us, but do we understand? A word of hope, a call to every woman and man. Light unto the end of time. Or is this just a waste of time? What if we run what out of time? Run out of time? Is this our Islam? Assalamualaikum. My name is Amina Ashfaq. I do glass work. Um, my mother is the artist behind. She does painting. Um, my great grandfather was an artist in Pakistan as well. So, alhamdulillah, I've been raised around art and been around art my whole life. Um, I've been doing glass work for about 10 years. Uh, I started in stained glass and then got bitten by the bug and I, I couldn't really stop. And so um, this is something that I, I love to do. My inspiration is mostly Islamic and contemporary art. I do a lot of abstract. Um, I think that that captures a lot of the essence of the beauty of uh, verses that I get inspired by. I don't like to recreate things that are um, already created in nature because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is done, you can't, you can't match that. So I work mostly abstract and I just try my best to um, make things that are beautiful and that glorify Him. Um, and, and alhamdulillah, I've, I've been blessed to be able to do it. Um, it's, a, it's, a, it's a true passion of mine and um, I'm very thankful to be here and thankful to be able to do this. Oh, the moon has come, the day is done, the night has covered up the sun. I have stood so often before you to pray, but I wonder, oh Lord, tell me what did I do today? Did I remember the words of Al Fatiha? Did I take time to thank you for all that I have? Did I call on you to guide my way? Tell me what did I do today? I have whispered to you as I made ruku Subhana Rabbi ala thee But was my faith bright or grey? Oh Allah, tell me what did I do today? Did I smile at my brother? Was I kind to my mother? Did I teach another something that I know? Or did my love of this world lead me astray? Tell me what did I do today? Sami Allah, Hamida. 
Assalamu alaikum. We are here at the Islamic Art Festival. And my gosh, there's so many people here today and just finished with Zohar. I am one of the featured artists here. I do the large, very large uh, mixed media paintings, um, watercolor and ink. Um, and it is large pieces of nature with calligraphy on it. Um, you cannot replicate nature. You cannot paint what Subhanatala paints, but you try. And the sunset and the trees and the mountains, just, oh, just, well, you try your best to capture a little bit of the, the beauty and the colors. Um, and I've evolved over the years. Um, may Allah accept a little bit of my efforts. Today I'm here with my daughter, Amina, who is doing the glasswork. So it's a mother-daughter team. And hopefully, hopefully, uh, God will grant her a long, healthy life, inshallah, so she can continue her work also. Uh, please pray for her. Do a lot of dua for her. She is suffering from cancer and, and, and is, is trying her best to put her work out and keep every moment of her life uh, occupied uh, in, in the work of Lord himself. So thank you so much for letting me be here today. I met the nicest of people. They've organized this affair, which is amazing. We need more of these affairs for the community, especially for the Muslim community, because there's so much of negative stuff that goes around. But today we have um, the interfaith people come by just now. We have everybody, non-Muslims, Muslims all together looking at art, which is like the essence of the spirit. It's, it's a passion and that's all. Um, helps you uh, heal, at the same time recognize God's glory and his uh, ultimate power. Thank you. Thank you. Jazakallah khair. Bow to you with my face in the dust. Subhana Rabbi Alana. Did I turn to you and did I obey? Oh Allah, tell me what did I do today? Did I use my time? Did I use my mind? If I search my heart, what will I find? The light of your guidance is a glimmering ray. Tell me what did I do today? Oh Allah. What did I do today? What did I do today? What did I do today? Assalamu my name is Sadia Faruqi. Uh, I started Faruqi Design in the summer of 2014. And um, basically we, uh, we do Huji Clay Art, which is a digital reproduction of fine art. And the process is basically sketching out a design, choosing out one of my favorite ayahs or hadith or popular sayings and choosing the right colors, um, and size, and I reproduce it digitally um, using graphic design software. And visit us on FrukiDesign.com. Can you hear the rhythm of Allah's creation? The rhythm of the clapping of the thunder and the rain. Can you see the rhythm of Allah's creation? The lightning and the leaves and the seasons as they change Watch the children in the field Spinning round and round Watch their lanky, dizzy, silly falls upon the ground They grip on to long grass Afraid of spinning with the sun Reality deceives them Neath a smiling mask of fun Can you hear the rhythm of Allah's 
creation, the rhythm of the children aging brown hair into gray. Can you see the rhythm of a lost creation, alternation of the moon and stars passing into day? Watch the grown-ups all twirling with the clock throughout the day. Watch them spinning through the hours while the time hands tick away. They talk and grip the world as they would catch a fallen knife. Reality deceives them beneath the musing games of life. Hi, my name is Nizar Makanodia, and I am based in Houston, Texas. And this is my artwork. Um, as you can see, I am trying to represent Islam on a canvas, which is not easy, as an Islam being such a simple and uh, very diverse religion. Uh, I like to represent that into my canvas. As you can see, I have done some paintings in oil and some of them are in acrylics. Um, I also do um, fine art, portraits uh, and uh, other art related projects for uh, non-profit um, institutions. Um, anyway, uh, thank you so much for uh, watching. Creation, the storm against the sand and the pulsating waves. Can you see the rhythm of a lost creation? The rhythm of the children running wind upon the graves. The rhythm of our world beats in surrender to Allah. Our blood and our breathing testify. The rhythm of surrender is a part of who we are With each heartbeat and involuntary blink of our eye A part of us we can't deny Can you hear the rhythm of the lost creation? The storm against the sand and the pulsating waves Can you see the rhythm of the lost Creation, the rhythm of the children running wind upon the graves. Um, my name is Ramez Kummer. I'm a partner in the Eye for Art Gallery. Uh, the gallery is based in Karachi. And um, we, uh, we specialize in investment work by, uh, by South Asian artists. Many of the works are calligraphic in nature, um, but they, they run a sort of a whole variety. Um, a month ago, one of our paintings was sold at a, a Sotheby's auction in London, and uh, I'm really pleased to, uh, to be here today and uh, to see so many people interested in, uh, in the, uh, the art and culture of uh, our tradition. Allah made us all a different shade and color Nations and tribes recognize one another Cause every single Muslim is your sister and brother So many different colors of Islam Fill the world with color painted everywhere you go Paint everything you see and tell everyone you know Quran will be your paint and your brush will be Iman So fill the world with color every color of Islam Truth is clear and blue as the sky we walk under Love is bright and loud as the lightning and thunder Peace is pure and white as the moon so full of wonder So many different colors of Islam Fill the world with color painted everywhere you go Paint everything you see and tell everyone you know Quran will be your paint So this is symbolize the beauty of God and starting with I'm Nihal Sönmez. Uh, I come from Turkey. Uh, this is traditional Turkish art. Uh, I am studying this art 11 years. It is taking your uh, too many time. This these are same time using for the therapy. I don't know. I'm saying what I'm reading there, <laughs> reading my paper, <laughs> copy. Mm. 
for the desire to live uh, symbolize beauty of the God. The other one, uh, Rose, Prophet Muhammad. I live, uh, I have been here six months. Thank you.